My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Got a really special car for you today. It's a 1969 Judge. Body off frame, rotisserie restored. Only a handful of Matador Red Judges were made. And I've got a binder full of uh, restoration receipts and another binder full of photos of the restoration process. Plus it has the Pontiac historical documentation. This is a real deal car, born like you see it right here. It's numbers matching. Go to volocars.com and you can take your time to look at all the pictures and read all the specs and you'll find price tags on every one of our cars along with monthly finance options as well. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. But for right now, join me, let's go for a spin. Carousel Red was the orange color that they put on most of the judges. Very rarely do you ever see a Matador Red Judge. Uh, that's what just drew me to it instantly. I just don't recall ever seeing one. Guy I bought it from said something like they made 17 of them or something like that, but I, I have no idea what the actual number is, but it is rare. Uh, and the stripe works out really well with the red. So just a really attractive car. Uh, we have pictures of the body stripped down to a bare shell on a rotisserie. So they flipped it upside down. They did the floors. They're, it's all original metal. The floors were rust-free original metal that were all you know, sandblasted, prepped, and painted. Uh, there's pictures inside the car with all the carpet completely out, and it's all clean, original metal. So the bottom of the body is all nice semi-gloss black. Uh, the frame and all the chassis components were sandblasted and painted. And when it was put back together, all new steering components, bushings, ball joints, springs, shocks, you name it, that all got rebuilt, replaced. This has the ride and handling package, which is the sway bars front and back and the boxed rear control arms. Uh, this has disc brakes in front. The brake system's all rebuilt, has stainless steel brake lines. The hoses were re, uh, replaced. E-brake assembly is new. A new fuel system, the tank, the straps, the sending unit, also stainless steel fuel lines. Uh, it does have a dual exhaust system with Flowmaster mufflers. Sounds real good. Uh, you look up at the motor, it is still spotless. Uh, Pontiac blue uh, oil pan. The fuel pump, the starter, they're restored. The actual matching VIN number on a Pontiac is down low. You actually look from underneath uh, up at the motor and the VIN number does match the car. Uh, it has a Muncie four-speed transmission and that all looks you know, fresh and restored and detailed. Rebuilt uh, drive shaft and it has 355 Posi uh, in the back. Pontiac calls it a safety track. Uh, so underneath the car is exceptionally nice, really nice under there. The body, uh, again, uh, original body panels uh, is on a rotisserie, so they were able to work on it from every angle, and the end result, it's absolutely straight. All the gaps fit real flush. The car was finished around 2018. They're all nice and square, and I already went around, and I was looking and feeling, and you know, I run my finger along here, there's no bubbles. The gaps are square, smooth, flush, straight, all fits real nicely. No damage, no rust, no dents. The hood fits nice. This is a functional ram air on the Judge, so it has the optional hood tachometer. The mirror, the door handles have been replaced. All the uh, window seals, gaskets, weather strips are all replaced. New windshield. The front rubber bumper fits really well. It does have some hairline cracks in the paint. Not in the bumper, but in the paint. There are a few hairlines. Uh, you just get that. They're rubber bumpers. Uh, the grills are cleaned up and restored real nice. They did put four T3 headlights. That'd be the original headlights in there. Uh, correct original antenna. The emblems are all new. 
All this stainless is real nice. Sometimes guys polish it like chrome. It's not like that, so it has a little tarnish to it. That's how stainless looks. Uh, but it's all straight and in real good condition. The wheels, uh, Rally 2 wheels, all restored. The judges did not come with trim rings, so that's correct. But does have new reproduction lug nuts that were unique to Pontiac as the uh, correct center caps. And those tires are the uh, reproduction red lines, but they're actually radials. They look like the original, but they are radials. Uh, the rear bumper's new, tail lights are new. Of course, you got the spoiler. The rest of the glass is very good original. You'll have some light scratches in it here and there. Windows roll up and down real nice. Uh, the paint itself, uh, it's beautiful. It's polished like glass. If you're looking for little imperfections, maybe that can be wet sanded out. I mean, if you're a body guy, you might be able to nitpick a few little things. Uh, I think there was one nick on the edge of the door right here, a tiny nick. This is all beautiful and like glass. Uh, but on this quarter panel on this side, and we might be able to wet sand it out. There's just something, something in the paint, like some shrinkage, I think is what it is in the paint. Right here in this one spot, we might be able to buff that out a little better. But other than that, the paint is really slick. Uh, so that's the outside. Why don't we uh, go inside and see what it looks like? So we have a really nice finished trunk compartment here. Uh, the spatter paint done very neatly. Nice gray and white spatter finish paint. Look how clean the metal is. Inner quarters, the, the whole trunk bay is beautiful clean metal. And of course we got the mat, we got a spare with the cover. Uh, there's a new wiring harness throughout the whole car. The red underneath the trunk lid in the jam is painted slick. Got a new sticker, new weather strip. There's also a restored jack hiding underneath the spare. Uh, this would be a good time to show you real quick. Uh, in the first part of the book, you have the Pontiac historical documents. They have the microfilm and can tell you how your car was born. Uh, so it's a real red four-speed GTO Judge, uh, 355 rear end. And then it gets into all the receipts. So here's a picture of the carburetor. It's the original restored carb. Uh, right manifolds, uh, but the receipts, these are almost all from Ames Performance. They are the Pontiac people, so you want quality Pontiac parts, you go to Ames Performance, and it just goes on and on in here. So there's receipts uh, for a lot of the work that's done, and here's the uh, pictures. I mean, there's the frame down to uh, bare, there's the body shell on a rotisserie, there it is flipped on its side. And it just takes you through the whole process of restoration. So uh, that's really nice to have. I wish all my cars came with that. So you have a beautiful, detailed, complete trunk compartment. And door jams are painted real slick and detailed. And weather strips are replaced and they fit nice. And of course the door panels all new and fits nice. The armrest, the trim, the handles, the window cranks, all of that's replaced. Uh, this is either a brand new dash pad or it was sent out and professionally restored. The dash pad's mint. Uh, it does have the rally gauges and a clock. And the, all of it is mint. The, the vents, the heater control panel, the knobs, uh, everything's in excellent shape with the exception of the AM radio. The actual dial is faded, but the radio looks nice, but the actual dial is faded. Uh, the glove box liner is new, a little tricky to open. Uh, you got the owner's manual. So we got a new console. The judge came with the T-handle, her shifter. Uh, new carpet fits real nice, reproduction floor mats, new cushions in the seats, new upholstery. All the trim on the seats, the headrest, uh, all the plastic, the chrome, it's all been replaced. A full set of reproduction GM seat belts. Does a plastic coating on the emblems there, but that's all new reproduction. The back seat, the side panels, it's all replaced. 
the headliner is redone. It's tight. Dome light works, visors, the mirror, all that's replaced. You got beautiful deluxe steering wheel. And then down below the dash, uh, you can open and close the Ram Air. If you're driving in the rain, you want to close it, uh, that's where you operate that. So this is the Ram Air 3. It's the 400, 366 horsepower. Motor was rebuilt, balanced. There's a, rec a receipt in the binder. I'm going to say it's very nicely detailed, very fresh. There's not many miles on this restoration. So the motor is painted the correct color, uh, right heads, manifolds, uh, carburetor, uh, rechromed uh, valve covers. The Ram Air system is complete. All the brackets, the pulleys uh, look like new. All the components, the alternator, the power steering, all that looks new. The wiper motor, uh, the squirters are hooked up. The power brake system, cadmium plated booster, uh, all that looks fresh. The whole cooling system, the radiator, the GM hoses, reproduction clamps, the shroud, the fan, uh, all looks right. Uh, spring clamp battery cables. Uh, so very, very nice numbers matching uh, engine show quality. So you have a really nice car here, nut and bolt restored, all red, no vinyl tops, not green or anything else, it's, it's red. Uh, four speed, judged, documented. These have been doing nothing but going up. Just recently at auction, these judges just rang the bell. So someone's gonna get a really nice car, they're gonna get a great value. The sign comes with it. I don't know when it was made, but it says 25 miles since completion. Uh, I don't think this car has been driven that much. Uh, so there you have it. That's my impression. Amazing car. Anyone would be proud to own it. Go to volocars.com. You can talk to the salesman. Give them your questions and concerns. They'll help you the best they can. They can help get this delivered to your door. They can help you finance it. It's at volocars.com. I hope you're enjoying these videos. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on that bell icon so you can be the first to see the next one posted. Thanks for watching.